Hello, hello, hello everyone. Uh, where is it? There we go. Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to a little video I am going to show. So, this is what I've been building in my spare time. So this is... Where is it? Right, no. Which one am I starting? Right. This is my train world, right? I love trains. This is how I'm going to prove it to you. Let's start off. So here we have is a black five. Yes, it's quite black. So most most of this was in 1.16.5. So yeah, that's your black five right there. So they, these are, the end rods are meant to be the um, railings, I, thought, I don't know. Right, you've got your coal here, you've got your firebox, there you go, look, there you go, you've got your firebox. Now, I use campfires as the steam, there you go. This is meant to be an E2 tank engine. It's not bad, I say to myself. They're meant to be the whistle. And then you go in here, and then there you go. You got the, you got the firebox again. Now this I do not know. See, um, so I found some kind of Thomas the Tank Engine meme, and I realised like there was an engine. There's like three middling engines I think called Neil, Clive, and Matthew. So I tried web. I tried recreating this and this is how far I've gotten and that's how far I'm gonna leave it as I mean it's not it's not it's not that good honestly it's not that good and then you've got the firebox I mean now I'm looking back at this it's quite bad honestly now we've got three size scales of Thomas the tank engine apparently yep do not copy me on that so, this is a standard gauge version of Thomas, that's a narrow gauge version, and this is an another narrow gauge version, but so much tinier. It's ridiculous. Now here, I do not know, but this is from, I, I do know, I, I don't want to do it black, because it would be a bit boiling. Bo boiling? Boring! Not boiling, alright, boiling. Good day, boiling, how are you? Right, anyways. Uh, so, I, for one thing, I know this is a British Railways, um, what do you call that? Train. I'm forgetting a lot of words here. Now, what's next? We're going to this. So these don't have any driving wheels because I wanted to be my own unique engine. So this is meant to be, yeah, that's it says central streamline. So this is my own two two oh. Oh no, two four. Yeah, two four. Yeah, two four oh. There you go. It's a two four oh. Now we we'll go inside. We have got our own firebox here and then you you can barely get the coal out it's very smooth as well you've got some coal up there so basically this one is only a coal burning engine so it doesn't need any water it's only coal burning loco but why is it having steam uh, if if only I had my own little weasel pack and I can make um and my little mod pack, and I, I can just make soul sand, um, what do you call it, soul sand juice, so then I can just say, oh look, um, this is a coal, uh, coal burning soul sand locomotive, and then it burns on soul sand, you see right there, anyways, this is meant to be a American diesel, this looks extremely ugly, but I have found some, ha somehow I've got some good redstone, I'm not saying I have good redstone. So I unflick the switch there. And now. 
Right, we're going back in there. Now, is it... Right, I forgot, I need to let these open. <coughs> there we go. So that's the exhaust, that's meant to be the exhaust, okay. Right, that's meant to be exhaust. The reason I put these trap doors here is for decoration. Now, this is a steam locomotive I made for a friend. So this is meant to be a 9F. Yes, 9F. So this is a 210. Yes, I know what it is. Yes. So I do. What I do know, a 9F is one of my. Well, one of my 10 favorite steam locomotives. I would say. Yeah, 10th, 10th favorite. So the 9F. I know there is there is one 9F that is in uh, the UK where I am the Yorkshire Railway oh no no not Yorkshire Railway wait National Railway Museum there is the Evening Star you can go and see that one there's a 9F there's a whistle and there is another 9F uh, at the Yorkshire Moors Railway that's also in York and if you go to um forgot the station right never mind right what am I doing right we've got two Stepneys here so we've got a bigger jumble size we've got a small tiny size so this bigger size here we are so you got you got you got a funnel that look like a chef hat this is meant to be a whistle which I do not like that's meant to be a boiler that's very small That's ridiculous. That's meant to be an automatic firebox. And I know Stepney doesn't have an automatic firebox. But leave as that. Don't like that one. This is my favourite one. It has little more detail. There. Uh, one moment to do. Here we go. Does. Wait. Does. No. It doesn't have a whistle. More well, kind of engine with no whistle. Now this. This is meant to be the um I forgot <laughs> what is the engine meant to be? <laughs> right, give me a second. Right, if it's without its tender. I was gonna do the tender but I gave up on the tender. Um There we go. The Duchess of Hamilton. So this is meant to be the Duchess of Hamilton. So you can see um oh what's this? I tried to do orange glass as the yellow lining coming from the cab to the front yep I don't like this at all and I haven't done the tender sadly what next well this is right here right so here we have is a locomotive so this is from one of the um, so the train, right? Go back to my other video. I will put on this. I will put on the screen at the end of the video. Um, the train mod video has this train in the inventory slots. You might not be able to see it, but I will. I will. I will put it on at. I will put it on at the end of the video to show you what I mean. Anyways, enough of that nonsense. That is one of my second favourite trains on the train mod. You might all be wondering what this is. <laughs> so this is another friend's train I was making. But I wanted to make a little joke. So that's a bullet and it says train. It meant to go over the top but never mind. So we've got a bullet train. Get it? Bullet train. Well, okay. Right, well I'll, I'll, I'll be quiet now. But if I be quiet then I can't do the video. Content mate. Right, anyways. This is meant to be a bullet train. I know it's quite rubbish, right? There we go. Here I am. Here we are, right? I opened two doors. Two doors better than one. Go away, go away, go away. I don't want copper, right? And is that it? Um, surely not. That's it. I know. I ha oh yeah. 
We're missing our mine. Here we are. This is mine. This is my own steam locomotive. As to number 19, it's a huge one. So this is a Bruno gauge. So it's going on the water tank right there. And ready for my own firebox door. How cool is that? Let me go here. That's amazing. That's my own whistle. I could do it in note blocks, but I would, I'm too bored to do that. That's the steam coming out. I'm doing cobwebs instead of, you know, um, glass. So, uh, this is a 4442. Yep, this is a 44. Four, yeah, this is a 4442. And I like it. So, these are meant to be single driving wheels at the back. So, big sing single driving wheels. These are two big, uh, two big driving wheels by themselves. So, yeah. What are these, what are these called? Uh, well, like these Sterling singles. There we go. They're called Sterling singles. Quite like them actually. Right. Are we done? Yes, we are. Right. Um. We're going to go to the train mod, okay? I will be right back with you people. Okay? Okay? Right, let me, let me just, let me, let me, let me, let me just find this. Here we are. Right, let's be quick. This is the locomotive fan. The BR01. We are not going to steam up and do the whistle and that stuff. You can search it online because I'm not in the mood. Right, you know what? Instead of doing that, we're gonna do let's do 40 straight. Boom. Ready, ready, ready. Look at that. Whoa, that's a big knock back. Now this is the engine I was trying to recreate. This is one of my second favorite. Well, no, one to five, one to five favorites. Just look at the amount of detail of that. Also has the number, the O, yeah, O one one five O. Look at that whistle as well. It's amazing detail. That's your, that's your tender right there. It, I'm guessing your water goes here. And you go on the back and you've got a good you've got a good view here and now we can go underneath look at this look how cool that is that's amazing that's incredible oh yeah the cow catcher and coupling right now uh, let me show you let me show you what I mean by Bruno. Actually, no. Let's do now. Let's quickly do now gauge, shall we? Minecart. That's like one block away. And just look at this cat. Oh, wait. Right, we'll go to the bigger one then since it has more. What? Huh? Right, this is being a pain. Look at this cab. This doors are swell and amazing. Just look at this cab, it's amazing. That's why I love this engine. And no, the, those, they look realistic. Look at that. Look at that, that's amazing. 
right can't forget model size and then we're gonna get to the laggiest part if this game crashes I'm blaming you I'm blaming the viewers who are watching this if your mind if your minecraft name oh duck if your minecraft name is called oh let me think of it um oh why do we have christmas on here hold up no 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 don't want christmas do we no we don't that's fine here we go right right sorry right We'll just do, we'll, no that's the tender, go away, don't want tender. Let's do that, do this. Look at this tiny model, to this minecart size. We've got narrow gauge, and we got standard gauge. Now we're going brunel. Now this shock my mind. We're gonna make, we're gonna extend this. Because this is too huge, oh. This is too huge to blow my mind. You ready? How cool is this? This is incredible. And if we just go like, let me, let me just go, right, let's just go out of here. Look at this cab. I mean, it's much more bigger. I think that's where you pull the blimmin' whistle. Or you might push a button and pull the whistle. Now, if we go in here, just like 3801. Look at that, it actually got the designs on the inside of an actual steam locomotive. So this is your firebox, I'm guessing. S some of these, uh, these might be boilers. I don't know much about an inside of a steam locomotive. Right, here we go. Then this is your smoke box. I mean, we've got another cool illusion here. Now if we just like stand, step, fly here. That's a good illusion now, I would say. And then you've got this funnel, so you've got the funnel as well. That look like a mini death star, actually. Like, shoved inside, right. There we go. Like and subscribe if you just love the video we have done. I have... Uh, done for you today and I mean this is amazing right have a good one fellas